Ellis Perks, Buxton next up for the Cradley Heathens and looking to repeat the performance from a few weeks ago against Stoke. Yeah, definitely. It um, was a really good um, really good result for me. Quite stoked with it. Um, hoping that my equipment's uh, up to scratch and I've been working on it all week, trying to get it ready and I'm um, looking forward to it. Obviously, Birmingham uh, very clear at the top of the minute, but it's important that the Cradley Heathens keep to winning ways and just keep picking up as many points as they can and hope Birmingham slip up at some point. Yeah, exactly. Uh, you know, they're looking uh, really strong at the moment. Um, they've got a very good team and they haven't dropped any points yet, but like you say, we're just going to do the best we can, keep winning as many matches and winning as many points as we can. Hopefully, we can claw away at their, vict- uh, their lead and uh, hopefully have a chance for the title. Buxton, not up there towards the top of the table, but they have also picked up some good results in the last few weeks, and they've got a few riders who could potentially cause a few problems. Yeah, definitely. You know, um, you can't go into any meeting expecting you're just going to win and score maximum points every day. You know, um, it's all tricky. You know, at the end of the day, it's speedway and it bite you on the bum any time that you're not really concentrating or giving it your all. So we're going to go there, and I'm giving it 100 percent, like everybody else in the team will. Hopefully, we can come away with a win. And obviously, it's the start of a busy few days. Three meetings in three days for the Heathens. Yeah, definitely. Um, looking forward to it though, because I've not been on the bike enough. This this should be good, you know. Um, doing the three meetings in a row and hopefully make a bit of money.